what if I am seen on another woman? So bloody what? And what if I am seen on another woman? So bloody what? So bloody what? You should stop crying every little time like a, like a, like a little child. Like a little child. Of, course. of course. Of course I am a man. And you need to adjust to that because you are a woman. And that's what other women do. Other women I said sorry the other time because I pitied you, not because you deserved it. So enough with your drama. I am fed up with you already, Chica. The world does not revolve around you, Chica. You are so, so lucky to be with me. None of my exes, not even the most beautiful girl I dated, would dare nag over me. Every little time, all you do is nag like the little bitch that you are. Chica, pick up. Pick up, Chica. Mom. 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 How much is it? The food. The food was gone in. So I already put it off. Oh. Thank you. I'm not doing Mom, good. What is to... it? You are crying. Um. No, I'm not. I'm, I'm fine. Go to the dining and I'll, um, I'll serve your breakfast. Mom? Go to the dining so you won't be late, okay? Mom? Yes. Happy birthday. Thank you. Thank you. Now, go to the dining I'll bring your food. Why are you looking at me like that, my sweet son? 
No, you look handsome. Breakfast is served. Mm. Uh, 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 honey, please, would you be taking Adobe to school or should I? And what will you be doing when I go to work? It's just that Linda had sent me some links and I want to check them out uh, and fill the forms for some... Job hunting, right? Uh, good morning. My name is Linda. Where are you calling from, Linda? I'm calling from Guarimpa. So who is the local person? <laughs> My best friend, uh, Chita. Today is her birthday. I just want to wish her a happy, happy birthday and a wonderful day. Oh, wow. Her friend, let me meet her friend. Who is happy birthday? <laughs> yeah, so she's a rare gem and I want to play her a song. Something that tells her how wonderful and amazing she is. All right, Linda, you're quite Thank you. So Chica, have you suddenly gone deaf? I ask you a question. Are you now back on your series of job hunting? What episode are we on? I I just I just wanted to give it another try. Another try. So you tell me now, of what use is your getting a job to this family? My self-worth. Your self-worth? Chica, your self-worth. You are working for a company for good eight years. What did you achieve? What did you gain? No investments, no savings, no fixed deposit, no... No, 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 no stocks. What did you gain? Nothing. All you did was waste eight years of your life working for another man. Chica, what did you gain? I gained experience. You gained experience? Wilfred, what exactly do you want me to do? You want me to sit here and tend to your needs? I have done virtually everything you've asked of me. You said quit your job, and I did. You said you, you said you didn't want another child after Adobe, and I complied. What more do you want from me? Do you want to know what I want? Do you want to know what I want? Just as much. Yes. Yes, I want to know what you want from me. I want to know what exactly you <laughs> You want to know what I want, right? Yeah. Huh? Chica, you want to know what I want? Well, I want you to understand that I am the man in this house and you are my wife. You do what I say, when I say it, how I say it. I want you to understand that you are the mother of my child and you are my wife. Do you understand? Do you understand? For how long? For how long, Wilfred? I am your wife for crying out loud. I am not some commodity that you picked up from the counter. I have feelings too. I, I deserve some respect. Wilfred, no. Wilfred, no. See? Wilfred, please. Now you have grown wings enough to reply your husband when he is talking. Wilfred. Try your husband when he's talking. Right? Are you mad? Why are 
还有我犯，不能放下。嗯嗯，将我拿一根，我拿一根来，我来做这个一块，来。你要追追翻你，爱不了手，追赶你，不要打你翻，不要打，不要攻击你，不要攻击你完成。啊！哎呦妈！哎呦妈！Your principal complained that you were fighting your classmates and also you didn't finish your homework. What's the problem? Ada, you know this is not how your mother and I train you, right? You can't go around school fighting people. What's the problem? Talk to me. What's the problem? Ada, you know you can talk to me. Yeah? You can tell me anything and I'll understand. What triggered it? What's... What's making you act it's like It's nothing, Dad. It's something because you would not go and start fighting people if it's nothing. What's the problem? I hear you and Mom arguing almost every night. And last night I wasn't able to finish my homework. And when the teacher called me, I was that your teen and started laughing at me. Well, your mom and I fighting. I mean, it's, it's, uh, <clears throat> it's normal. You know, it's what couples do. Every couple fights. For the makeup, you understand. So, so I think that that that's that's just it. Because mom is always crying and sad. That's because your mom is emotional. She's very emotional. She cries over everything, even when it's just a little misunderstanding. She starts to cry. I cannot control that. For other, look, the other girl laughing at you. Why should that make you upset? It doesn't make you less of a human being or less than who you are. Okay? You have no reason to fight. Do you understand? I just want both of you to stop fighting. I know mom won't tell me anything, but I see how sad she is every time. She has to stop fighting with mommy. So, now you're now supporting your mom, right? Huh? You're now supporting your mom. I'm talking to you. It's mom's birthday today. Damn it. I completely forgot. <sighs> Can I get her a gift? I'm sure it will make her smile. Now I know while Chica was acting like a dog. Yeah. Right? Um, it's because first I, I know it's mom's birthday. I didn't forget. Damn. I just, um, you know, I actually got a gift for her. And I had plans of surprising her. Really? Yes. Yes. Thank you, daddy. You're the best. <laughs> well, what can I do? Okay, um, we just to be out on and uh, I could have at least gone to where I got today. Well, I guess I'll make it up to her. Hey, girl! Hi! Hi. I've been calling you. What's up? Oh, you, um, I, I must have left my phone. Yeah. So. Anyway, happy birthday, girl! <gasps> what? You didn't see all the calls I've been calling you. I can send you a shout out on radio. For real? Yeah. Come on in, come on in. Come in. Oh, thank you. Yeah. For once, I thought we were going to be locked outside again. Thank you. It's such a beautiful cake. You're welcome. What flavor is this? Well, we'll just, it's a surprise. It is. <laughs> oh, thank you. Thank you, darling. You're welcome. And this is for you. <gasps> You're not done. I'm not done. But don't worry about it. Look at it later. Okay. <laughs> So Chica, how are you? You don't look happy. I'm, I'm fine. You're fine? Mm -hmm. No, I can tell. I mean, how can you even be fine if you're still living with that man? And I know you can try to hide it as much as you can, but look at me. Look at me, Chica. I can see through your eyes. Not now, Linda. 
Let me get you something to drink. I'm not thirsty. I'm not the one who's thirsty here. Somebody's thirsty for some love and respect. Can we please not talk about this today? Okay, 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 fine. I mean, it gets tiring talking about it over and over again anyway, so... I'll have a soda if you have one. I'll be right back. You didn't tell me today was your birthday. I didn't know I had to remind you. <laughs> so you think I spend my whole day just thinking about you, right? It's okay. My birthday is not that important. Well, my daughter insisted I got a gift for her mother. And besides, that gift is very expensive. You should at least say thank you. Well, I'm sure the shop owners won't mind taking it back and giving you a refund. That money can be put to good use. And besides, those who really care already wished me a happy birthday, so. What's with this attitude of yours? Huh? You know what? Don't mind. Expecting anything good from you is like pouring water in the basket. Hey, sweetie. Mm. What's good today? Me too. Oh. I forgot. Hey, baby. I'm sorry. You're welcome. Now, let me get this on. Finish your food. No, I'm full. I know what to do my homework now. Oh, okay. That's fine. Bye, Daddy. All right, baby. Linda, huh? I can see how Linda is influencing you, right? Well, Linda is an established woman. She's a lawyer. And a very good one at that. If she's influencing me, isn't it for my own good? Well, she's single. I mean, she's about your age or... Maybe older, she's still single. Is that the kind of friends you want to keep? What's wrong with her being single? I mean, it's not like it's everyone that wants to get married. So don't drop quotes. Excuse me? Well, I honestly don't care what you want to do. But. Maybe when you go out there and try getting a decent job that might help, you would see that it's not easy. And you also understand that the corporate world, even if you're married, you will still be subject to sexual abuse. Well, let me remind you that I worked for eight years and you didn't get me that job. Hmm. Neither was I exploited sexually, so... I want to try and say. What am I? Hey. 
Okay. Okay. I I think I must have eaten something. But let, let me just go check on the food. Stay right there. Chica, is there anything you want to tell me or do we need to go see a doctor? The constant nagging. Irritations, mood swings, and your breast. It's fuller. Are you pregnant? Answer me, are you pregnant? Answer me. Have you known this? I, I just found out a couple of days ago. <sighs> so you stopped taking your medication? Side effects are killing me and... What I side don't... effects are you talking about? You can't deal with common side effects, but yet you want to raise a, vill a village? What are you talking about? You only have one child. Do you have savings? Do you have money stocked anywhere? What do you have? Do you know how hard, how expensive it is to maintain the standard of living that we have right now in this country? Well, I have a right to decide how many children I want to have. I have no single right. I gave you strict instructions. Take the damn pills. Let us manage one child now, and in the future we can have another child. You won't listen. The future? What are you talking about? Do you know how old I am? Is it when I reach menopause that we're going to start trying for another child? Chica, how old are you? Well, so if you're so eager to reach menopause, how is that my business? Do you know how many women out there are willing and eager to have a child? But let me tell you something. I'm going to work. By the time I come back, that thing there, that thing should be taken care of. Okay? So you're just going to abort the pregnancy simply because a hoodlum told you to do so? Shh, please keep your voice down. Uh, I don't, don't be so upstairs. I don't care who can hear me upstairs or who can hear me wherever. I don't care. Chica, this is the height of it all. For 14 good years, that man has held you captive. 
Is, is this what you call marriage? He's not really a bad person. He's just temperamental, that's all. Wow, and you're still defending him. What would you have me do? He's my husband. And he's not your husband. He is not your husband. Husbands don't treat their wives like this. Chica, that man is your slave master. And the sooner you liberate yourself from this thing, these shackles you call marriage, the better for you. Or you might just go down in history as one of the most stupid women ever. <sighs> Chica, 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 I've told you, I have friends, colleagues who are very good divorce lawyers. Let us help you out of this, eh? I am. Um... <laughs> what? He's back. And so? I, I didn't know he was coming this early. And so what? I, I, I haven't made his dinner. And. So what? Are you going to be running Helter Skelter now? Uh, so this is why this man told you to quit your job, so you can become his personal uh, slave, eh? Chica, <laughs> Chica, that man is a horrible narcissist. That man does not care about you, does not love you, neither does he respect you. I'm, 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 Linda, I'm sorry, I, I have to. All right, all right, I'm leaving anyway. I don't think I can breathe the same air with that beast of a man. Take care of yourself, Chica. You deserve better, and so does your daughter. Okay. Call it Excuse me. Oh, welcome. So what did your lawyer advise you to do? Did you at least follow my advice and see the doctor? Wilfred, I do practically everything you ask me to do in this house just so that peace will reign. And this one? Is it too hard for you to do? No, it's not hard. It's impossible. Because I would rather die before I let anyone touch the child growing in my womb.
Linda. Hmm? We're just a few blocks away. Why did you bring me here? Why didn't you just sit at home? Why did I bring you here? I mean, I wanted to. And besides, I wanted us to do something besides eating at your house. And so you can have a bit of fresh air. Thank you. You're welcome. So before we get into your problems, here. What are you going to eat? My treat. She's just blushing. Oh, where are my manners? Sit down, sit down. Please join are, are us. Are you sure about that? Yeah. No, 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 no. Sit, sit, sit. Oh my god, sit. Okay. What? Goodness. So how have you been? Well, I've been fine. Mm -hmm. Well, mm -hmm. fine. Mm -hmm. yeah. Oh, okay. So what? Uh, when did you come back from the UK? About a um, couple of months now. Yeah. I'm sure you probably you're married with like kids. Oh, what am I saying? You are married with kids. I'm sure, like three or four. How many? Well, I'm divorced. Oh. No kids. Sorry. No, it's fine. It's, fine. it's nothing. <sighs> um, <clears throat> I guess we weren't meant to be together. Okay, so I think I should take my leave now. What? No, but you haven't touched your food. I, I know. Uh, okay, I think maybe I should get that. No, no way, no way. Oh, look at that, I have a phone call. Now, if you will excuse me, you two be good, okay? You're going nowhere. Yes, I'm, um, hello? So, I... Uh, how are you? Fine. Mm, I see. You see what? Well, I see that you're mm. fine. Did I miss? Well, nothing much. Uh, look, I need to be on my way now. I actually came to get a uh, takeout, and I have work to do too. Okay. And I have work to do. All right. Are you sure you have work to do, or did your ex-girlfriend tell you to leave? Linda. What? What? I'm just taking the obvious now. You know, you guys made a few couple back then, and I've always rooted for you guys. Can we please not talk about this now? Okay. Okay. Well, all I'm saying is. Maybe God is just trying to repair what was messed up in the first place. You know what, I, I'm glad that you, you're doing well and you're happy. <coughs> Are you okay? <coughs> mm. Sorry. Oh, you know what, I have to be on my way now, okay? Oh, okay. I don't know if, uh, if you don't mind. 
I would like to invite you over to my house warming. It's this Friday. Oh, yes, 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 of course. Okay. I'm, I'm sure we will definitely be there. Okay. Great. Okay, so, um, the details? Mm, mm. We'll get Chico's number. Hmm? Or do you want me to call it out for him? Welcome. I... I spoke with Dr. Charles. And I booked an appointment for you tomorrow at the hospital. So make sure you... you meet up with him, okay? I don't need to see a doctor. Listen, Wilfred, I will not terminate this pregnancy and I don't care how you feel about it. It's my pregnancy, isn't it? Or does it belong to someone else? So you will do exactly what I say. No questions asked. Then grant me a divorce. Yeah, because it's okay if you don't want the child. I will have this baby and look after it myself. But what I will not do is to abort it. What did you say? Chica, you want a divorce? You want to leave me? You want to leave this marriage? But let me tell you something, Chica. You will do no such. You dare not try leaving this marriage. And Chica, if you try to leave this marriage, I will look for you. I will find you. I will ruin you. You lie. You lie. I will not stay in this marriage. I will not stay here being cooked up like a criminal. I deserve to live and be happy. Chica, you are happy with me. No, I am not. Look around you. Is this happiness? I am done. I am done with the sham of a marriage. I am done being treated like this. I am done. I need to get out. I want out and I want a divorce. Ah! You are ah! Okay, why are you here by this time? Nothing. Okay, go. Tell me what happened. Did... Did he do something? Linda, please. Can I spend the night here? But, but, but of course, you know you're always welcome here. But you need to tell me, what, what happened? I don't want to talk about it. Not now, please. Not now. Okay. Okay. No problem. You just just sit down, relax. I'll go and get the guest room ready for you, okay? Thank you. All right. Yes. Oh. 
Honey, is your mom back yet? Okay. All right. Uh, here's some money. Please don't get lunch from the school canteen, okay? Daddy, why did mommy leave? Um, as I told you before, she went to Yabati in the house of some things. She'll be back before you come back from school. Now, hurry up with your food and meet me in the car. I'm waiting. about Adobe. I don't know. I don't know if she's eating this morning. I don't even know what she's eating this morning. All right, all right, all right. Stop fixing her. She's with her father at home, so I'm sure they'll figure something out. Yeah, but I don't think that. What I, I... Listen, listen. You came here to relax, right? You're here to do just that. You came here to get away from all your problems. I don't know. Okay. Oh. oh, he's here. Who's here? Calm down. Who's here? Calm down. Calm down. Relax. 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 Come on. Just relax. Relax. Okay? I'm coming. Relax. How dare you? I mean, how dare you invite Steve here? I was only trying to help. How is this helping? By involving him in my marital problems? Um, Steve cares about you and I know he does. And besides, maybe you would listen to him. What is wrong with me? I am with Wilfred now. Steve is in my past. But this is the same reason why we're all here today, worried about you. About you? Do you even understand? Do you even know how embarrassing it is discussing my marital problems with my ex? Chica, first of all, no one is perfect, okay? No one is. And Steve, Steve is divorced. And we're all here trying to save you, save you from this marriage. And I've been telling you since, I've been telling you for years now, leave this marriage, leave this marriage. You won't listen to me. Chica, you won't listen to me. So maybe, I don't know, you would listen to Steve. I, I don't know. Wait, wait, What right do you think you have to ask me to leave my marriage? I mean, you are not even married. Steve is divorced. What makes you any better? Chica, can you please listen? Can you please listen to me? Chica, what do you want? No, really, what do you want? Hmm? Is it when you die first, that's when you now get some sense? Do you want to die before you get some sense, really? Do you realize that you ran down here in the middle of the night, in your condition. And I could see the fear in your eyes. What was telling Steve? Yeah, but he will eventually know. He would, when something happens to you, he would know. And so will the rest of the world. And guess what, my darling? Your darling Wilfred will marry another woman. And you'll be left alone to raise your daughter. Is that what you want? Do you want him to raise your child alone? Also, tell me, is this the type of life you want for your child? Is this really what you want? Do you want her to tolerate this life, this mess, from a man as well? Is this the example you're setting for her? Tell me. Listen, Chica, I'm begging you. Now, I'm begging you. Please. Please. Not for me, oh, but for your daughter and your unborn child. Chica, you need to leave.
Chica. Steve really loves you. And you guys are great together. Look, you know distance is what separated you both, not hate. I know he cares for you and I know he will protect you. What do you want? I'm sorry to interrupt you guys, but there's someone at the door. Okay, I, I'll, I'll get that. It's fine. Get out of this house. Get out of this house hey, right now. Listen, okay? I am not here to banter words with you. Now go in there and get my wife out for me. She is not here, so get out! So Lila, you're not just a, a cheap whore. You are actually a professional liar. How dare you? How? What, 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 what is this? Bring it down! Look, okay. I don't want issues with you, okay? Go inside there and get my wife down if you don't want me to go and start scattering things in this house. Are you hearing me? And I have had enough of your interference. Enough of your interference in my marriage. You have done too much already. You useless neighbor you are. He's here. You know what? God, you I just... am so tired. Listen, just take it easy, okay? You don't have to panic. <laughs> You don't know him. Yes, but I know you. But honestly, this is not the you I remember. Oh. I have to go out there. Oh. Listen, you can't. I, can't. I have to. If I don't go out there, he's going to cause problems for Linda. So? So? I mean, since he's good at causing problems, then let him go ahead. Tim. You don't know the kind of toxic man that I'm married to. I have to go. Listen, you're not going anymore. I have to. I have to. Go to the car. I Come must on. go out there. Don't say it again, okay? Go upstairs there and get my wife down for me, okay? She will not come. You don't want my trouble, Linda. You don't want my trouble. Go upstairs. I thought you said my wife was not here. <laughs> Look who we. Ay, yay, yay. Yay, yay. Chica, my dear wife. So, this is the reason you left your matrimonial home to come here and prostitute. What are you saying? What am I not saying? Huh? You left your matrimonial home to come here and prostitute with this. Ah, oh, I mean, Linda introduced you to someone to have sex with you. Right? Oh, Fred, you need to shut up. Watch what you're saying. Uh, you're getting this all wrong. Listen, him and I. Him and you what? Who is he to you? Who are you to him? Huh? <laughs> oh, how many rounds did you guys have last night? I mean, look at him. He looks like he was sweating all through the night. Okay, well, Fred, you need to stop now. I have stopped. So tell me, how much did he pay you? What are you talking about? He's a friend. He's just an old friend. An old friend? That makes it even worse. Or show free. What? So you had sex for free or it's an affair. I mean, your friend here gets paid for sex. So why, 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 why couldn't you get paid? And how am I even sure that the pregnancy is mine? Chica, Chica. You need to tell this man to get the hell out of my house or else I'll have him arrested for trespassing. No, no. Just look at you. This money has the shake. Okay, Chico, yes, but I think you've gotten it all me. wrong. Are you ready to go back home with me when you're not done yet? She's not going anywhere with you. Is that so? You're not going anywhere with me? Are you not coming back with me? I'm talking to you. Chica, don't listen to him. We're here for you. I'm here and so is Steve, okay? Steve. Steve. <laughs> the 
the same Steve, your ex-boyfriend? No, I mean, yes, but oh. it, it, it's not what you think. Oh. It, listen, it's, oh. it's not what you think. Take away your Let go of me! What do you want him to think of me now? It's bad enough that he doesn't want this child. Now this, this is my marriage. I need to save it. What you want to say? Everything, Linda, everything. My life, my dreams, my daughter. 14 years of my life, Linda. You know what? You need to stop interfering. I'm, I'm sorry I, I came here last night. It won't happen again. Excuse me? No. What is wrong with her? I mean, she's obviously brainwashed, Linda. I mean, that's what abuse does to people. I mean, that guy strikes me as a narcissist. So manipulated to the core. Oh my goodness. I mean, do, you know what, do you know what these people do to their partners? I mean, they turn them to crazy people with low self-esteem. I mean, anxiety sets in, you know, they get uh, trauma bonded. And before you know it, you know, constantly get into soul searching. I mean, that explains their odd and cold behavior. And it doesn't end there. I mean, gradually they end up getting addicted to their pains. And before you know it, they actually lead themselves from family and friends. So pathetic. I mean, these victims are made to feel like they are the ones to be blamed, that they are the ones with the problem, that they are guilty. That man is a beast. He needs help. No, 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 no. He doesn't need help. I mean, people like that don't change. They don't ever change. Chica is the one who needs help. I mean, she needs to get out of that relationship before that guy uh, tears her apart. Before he destroys her completely. So sorry. I was mistaken. I, I shouldn't have said the things I said to you. I shouldn't have used such words on you. You are a dutiful wife. You are rare. And I know deep down inside your heart, you can never cheat on me. You will never cheat on me. Forgive me. I'm sorry. And I just want us to, to fix us. To fix you and I. Please tell me that we can we can work on us. Please answer me. But I no, no, no but. Look, I, I, I know that I get upset really fast. I get angry unnecessarily. I say the worst things. I I react in awful manners towards you. But for us, I am willing to take anger management classes. I just want us to work out. Just give me another chance, okay? I don't want to lose you. It's okay. I wasn't going to divorce you, really. I was just... Uh... I, I actually didn't think you would the first time. When I saw you reuniting me... Oh, Steve is my ex. And that's what he is. He just happened to come into the country and I, I ran into him. That's it. It's nothing more. But I know how much you used to love him. Used to. But it's you that I love now. 
and I'm sorry about the way I ran off. I'm sorry too. I should never have raised my hands on you. Especially knowing that you have our baby growing inside you. Please forgive me. It's okay. There's always a room for a second chance. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you, baby. Thank you, too. I love you so much. Thank you, too. Hey! Look what we have here. Come in. Thank you. Oh, wow. You look beautiful. Thanks. You have yeah. a nice place. Thank you. I'm trying. Well, make yourself comfortable. Oh, thank you. Okay. You're I, okay there. Right, fine. I thought fine. you said this was a housewarming party. Uh, yes, it is. Um, with friends. And apparently you and um, Linda happen to be the only friends I have in this neighborhood. <laughs> <laughs> Well, Linda is going to be running late. She went to get some things. Oh, okay. Okay. Um, so, uh, what do I offer you? Steve. Yes? I, I want to apologize for the other day, for the way I spoke to you. And Linda, I was really out of order. No, no, it's, it's, it's nothing. Okay, it's nothing. It's something. I'm sorry, I shouldn't have said the things I said. Please forgive me. All right, it's fine. Apology accepted. As long as you, Chica, you're happy. Hmm? So, what do I offer you? Do you want it soft or hard? I'm pregnant. Oh, right back. I'm sorry. Okay, so um, let me get you something soft then. Thank you. I'll be right back. Oh, so good to see you. Wow. Okay, thank you. Wow. Oh my. You know, I wish <laughs> clothes really, 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 really do justice to people. Though. If only your personality will show on this your ancient culture, people would know who you really are. Hi Linda, how are you? I don't even know how to feel about you. Around you. I don't know. You know, I really don't have time for, for all of this, you know. Ah, you don't have time. But you have time to beat up women and try to abort children, have you? <laughs> well done. So Chica told you all this, right? No, you did. With every slap, have you forgotten? With every slap you gave her, you left a mark. Like I said, I don't have time for all this. And besides, it's really bad for my personality to be seen standing with a prostitute. <laughs> you know, I really, really feel sorry for you. you know? Only weak men beat up women. And that is what you are, a weakling, weak as shit. Excuse me. I wish you the best with your customers today, prostitute. Wow. Okay, so, um, here you go, you are. Yeah. Thanks. Ah, okay. oh. uh, well, I hope Linda comes in. I wonder in. what's keeping Linda. Yes, I wonder too. My phone's ringing. Okay. Oh my god. It's Wilfred. Pick it. It's not like we're doing anything wrong, are we? Hello? Where are you? I'm, I'm not at home. I know you're not at home. I said, where are you? I'm at Linda's. Where is Linda? She's here. Linda! Linda! I, oh, I, I think she's gone to the kitchen. You at Linda's place and Linda is right there with you. Yes. Is there a problem? Nothing. I'll see you when I get home. Okay, bye. What I, happened? I, I, I think you doubted me or something. Why did you have to lie? I don't know. I just blotted out the first thing that came to my mind. I, I just don't want to be in trouble. Okay, you know what, just uh, have your juice, okay? 
Just relax, relax. Come on. Let me call Linda to know where she is. Please. Just hold on, hold on. Dinner is served. Darling. It's time to eat. Come on, let's go. Chica. You have the thoughts to lie to me. Wilfred, have you been drinking? Have I been drinking? Yes, I have been drinking. I drank because you fooled me. I drank because you lied to me. I drank because I needed to ease my pain. Chica, where were you? You went to his house. You went to see him, right? No. Yes. You want to see him, right? Huh? You want to see him! You want to see him, right? Chica, come here. You went to see him. You cheap whore. You cheap whore! You told me that you love me. You told me you it was only me. me. You, you told me I was the only one in your life! Wilfred, you said it was your ex. Wilfred, what is your past? You lied to me! You lied to me, Chica! You lied to me! You lied to me, right? Uh, why would you lie to me? Can't do 
this no more. Can't do this no more. Can't do this no more. Sit down! Sit down! I put this down! Sit down! Sit down! I put this down! Chica, you know, if I get into that room, I will kill you! I put this down! You can't hide from me, Chico. You can never escape me. No matter how hard you try. You love to Please come and open the door. Hey, what's your room? Run! Chica! Chica! So the little puppy has landed. I, huh? I, I So I take it now you are the, the hero that has come to save the day. What kind of dog are you? You're a chihuahua, a bingo. What kind of dog are you? Look, 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 listen, I am not here for trouble. All I want is to see Chica, please. As what? Please, I want to know where Chica is. Please. You came here to see my wife. To see her as what? Who is my wife to you? Listen, I'm not here for, I'm not here for trouble. Olga! Who is my wife to you? All right. Your wife is... Is what? No, never mind, never mind. Is what? Is what? Is what? Who is it to you, my friend? Who is my wife to you? I'm, not, I'm asking you! Who is... Chica! 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 It's me, Steve, where are you? Chica! Sit down, sit down, sit down, sit down, sit down. Just relax and sit down. Okay. He comes here. Empty the door. The door. Listen, just relax, okay? He's not coming here. He's not going to get anywhere close I, to you. I, I think I should leave because I'll, I'll, I'll be putting you in harm's way. No, you're not going anywhere. I mean, going back to that man is definitely going to hurt you. I'm so sure of that. What? I mean, what is there to worry about, Chica? Uh, this is my house. You're in my house. Don't you trust me? Steve. Look, Chica. You called me, right? You called me to come save you. So 
Relax, all right? Please. Okay, um, you know what? I will get a first aid kit to attend to your wounds then. I'll fix you up something to eat. And freshen up at. I'll get you some clothes. Hope you don't mind. Come on, it's all right. It's all right, okay? Come on. Get some rest now. You'll be fine. Okay. Sorry. Stay fine. Yes. Why are you doing this? I've not done anything special. I'm only doing what every reasonable man will do. I mean, saving you from that monster. Thank you. You're welcome. Um, I'd like to ask you something. Why are you tolerating all of this? Why? Chica, listen to me. Easy, easy, easy. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Chica, you're beautiful. You're intelligent and smart. I mean, why are you letting that monster get the best of you? Why? It's not that easy. What's not easy? You're divorced, right? If marriage was a bed of roses, you'd still be with your wife. <sighs> wow. Well, I... I left because it was getting toxic. Not that I was perfect. Neither am I blaming her or anything. But... We just realized it wasn't working and we decided to go our separate ways. I mean, coping with the lies and the emotional abuse was not just it at all, it was it? Well, Steve, not everyone has that courage. Chica, look, all you need to do is to look yourself up in the mirror. Chica, you deserve better. You deserve to be happy. You deserve a happy marriage with, with, with love and trust. Steve. Look, I'm sure you know that people die in abusive relationships. I wouldn't want that to be your story. No. Please. Okay. So, um, I, I, I'll show you. I will show you to your room now. Okay. So I'm sure once you get enough rest, by tomorrow you'll be fine. Okay. All right. Okay. Let me, let me just quickly pack this up. Chica, it's me. Chica, it's me. I brought you coffee. Uh, 
What's in your clothes? Chica. I brought you coffee. Chica. 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 What? Chica. Chica. Okay, no, so get the necessary things ready for surgery, okay? Okay. Yeah, yes, young man. Yes. You know, I really don't know who this young lady is to you, but she has lost a lot of blood. <gasps> So you just need to calm down, okay? Okay. We will do our best to right. so make sure everything is all right. All right, okay. all right. Thank, thank you very much, Doctor. Thank you. I'll see you. Thank you very much. Oh. Pick up your phone, pick up your phone now. Where are you? Pick up your phone. Pick up the goddamn phone! I'm listening to you. Officer, what do you mean you have not found him? What do you mean you can't find him? Look, I want that man found and convicted for killing my wife. <laughs> Officer, listen. Even if you have to search everywhere, the whole city, if you have to swim in the water, if you have to go under the bridge, find that man. He killed my wife, of course. He came here and he took the polity and he went, he, 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 he went there and... He killed my wife. That's what I'm trying to tell you. His name is Steve. Yes, I have sent you his name. I've sent you his address. I've sent you every, every, every information that you, that you need. Yes. Officer, find that man. Find him. Thank you. What kind of selfish person are you? What kind of what kind of selfish woman are you? Huh? You just died. Small bits in the bit you, you die. Is that how they used to die? Is that how they used to die? Now you've left me alone. You've left your daughter alone. You cannot even think before dying. You have a daughter in the house. You've left the poor girl to grow without a mother. Your small thing, you just died. Very selfish act. May God forgive your soul. 
See all the streets I'm passing through now. Detective Usman from Fort Division. Have you found the person that killed my wife? Have you found my wife's murderer, Steve? His name is Steve. Have you found him? Um, Mr. Wilfred, there's been some reports against you on domestic violence, of which we believe must have resulted to your wife's death. That is preposterous. I have never laid a finger on my dear wife. Never ever laid a finger on her before. And did you know that my wife was pregnant before she died? Who on his normal sense would ever hit? I'm not supposed to be crying. I'm a man here. Who in his normal sense would ever hit a pregnant woman? Would you hit a pregnant woman? What's a lie? Would you shut up your mouth? Shut up. Everyone knows that you have always hated me. Linda, what have I ever done to you in this life? What? Why do you hate me so much? Look up, if my wife and I ever had any issues in this relationship, it's because of the bad advice that she got from this witch. This equine right here. The evil advice you gave my wife. But I never, ever hate my wife. My wife and I never got to the point where we would need to exchange words for you could step physically violent. Oh, wow. My wife is dead. The murderer is out there right now and I, you are standing here wasting time. Listen to me and stop listening to this, this, this charge and bail lawyer. Um, but Linda here is standing as Chica's friend and as a witness what, as well. What, what, what witness is she? What kind of witness is she? Linda, have you ever lived here before? Do you live in this house? Have you ever seen me hit my wife before? What witness? As soon as we have enough evidence to connect you with her death, I will stand here as a lawyer and make sure that you rot in jail. Officer, as you can see, I just, I just lost my wife. I just lost the love of my life. You understand that? My daughter and I, I'm passing through a lot. I cannot be doing this right now. My in-laws are coming here over the weekend to plan a burial. I can't. Chica will not be buried without an autopsy report. And why did you decide that? Her friend. What kind of friend are you? What kind of friend are you, Linda? Your friend is dead. She's in the mortuary. And here you are trying to break what's left of her home. You want to get her husband arrested. Linda, you, 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 you are evil. <laughs> Because that's what you deserve. Um, um, Mr. Wilfred. Mr. Wilfred. Yes. Um, I was made to understand you have a 13 year old daughter. Mino. A 13 year old. I only have Mino. some questions for her. I'll go and get her. Hey, no. Listen. I'll get my daughter. You know, she just lost her mom. She's. It's passing through a lot right now. I'll get my daughter. Okay. I'm telling you, he's going to manipulate that girl's testimony. Oh, Linda, calm down. He is her father. Like he said, the little girl is just a minor. So let him bring her. Okay, all right. Sure. You see what I'm saying? Oh, honey. Uh, Daddy has something to tell you. And uh, I hope you would listen to me. So, um, 
officer, please. I would handle my daughter. Thank you. Hello. Don't be scared. My name is Usman. I'm a detective. Um, I'm here to make findings about your mother's death. You know, people are saying your father used to hit your mom. And that the night she ran away, that your dad was hitting her, and a man came and took her away. I don't know anything. Ada, it's okay actually. You can talk to the detective. Uh, uh, officer, you heard my daughter loud and clear. She didn't speak in Spanish or French. She said she didn't know anything. Oh, shut up. Only God knows what you would have told her upstairs. Hey, hey Linda, that, that's listen. enough, guys. Are you saying you don't know anything? Are you saying your dad does not used to hit your mom? No. Officer, you're, you're pushing the video care out. So you have to do stuff. Hey, she says she doesn't know anything. Wilfred. Wilfred, what have you done? She looks so scared. Look, you should stop pushing on this, on this agenda of yours, okay? Stop pushing on it. And obviously, I am, I am disappointed in you. The person that killed my wife is out there. He's out there. Only God knows what, what, what he's doing out there. And you're out here harassing me and my innocent daughter? Why? Why? Now, if you would excuse me, I need to go and spend some time with my, my daughter, okay? Only God will save your soul. Only God will save your own soul first and heal your heart from hatred. You are just plain evil. Now, officer, I need to go be with my, my daughter, okay? See you Let's go. Don't worry about that. But I told you. We'll have it sorted. I told you. Don't worry. We'll fix it. Why do you insist on meeting? Well, what are you doing? How do you mean? You and I know that man is guilty. He is responsible for killing his own wife. Innocent. And to prove him guilty. What other proof do you need? Linda, you are a lawyer. Why not do your job and allow me to do mine? Yes, but I know how manipulative that man can be. What do you think I am? Stupid? See, I've been in this job for a very long time. We've seen different kinds of people, even hiding criminals. You have to manage to break them. Okay. But I'm telling you, you've never seen anybody as devious and as manipulative as that man. I just hope that you get my friend the justice that she deserves. Oh. Hello? Yes. Steve. Okay. I'll be on my way now. Ada, Adobe, Ada, Ada, Sorry, Dad. There's nothing to be sorry about. You did the right thing, okay? 
but I lied. Um, what lie did you tell? You used to hate mom a lot. You, you're right. And I regret it. I, I wish I never did. But I am not capable of doing the things they said I did. Linda just wants me to go to jail. But mom is dead. She's dead. Yeah, I know. And I, I regret it. I, I wish I could turn back the hands of time. But God knows best. God gives life and God takes. Like, um, at least I'm here. I'll be your father and I'll be your mother, okay? Let's go and eat lunch. Hmm? Come on, let's go. to be sorry about, okay? They did nothing wrong. Nothing. Let me get the door. Linda, what did you want again? What do you want? I thought I had made it very clear to you that there is nothing you can find here. Look, officer, my daughter and I are trying to make it through this ugly incident and you keep coming here. What do you want from us? What is it? Dad. Daddy, I was one that called Aunt Linda to come here. So why did you call her to come here? Why? What did you tell her? Who? Oh, do you not worship her the same way your mother worships her? Uh-uh, uh-uh. You need to watch the way you speak to that child and mind your tone. Oh, what? What will you do, Linda? What will you do? <laughs> Wilfred, I am not your wife. I will not condone that. Now, would you shut up, you little mannequin? Daddy, please. Stop. Okay, now you ask her what you want to ask her. You tell them what you have to tell them. Okay? So you can go. Ask Linda, I want to tell you the truth. The entire truth. I don't... Oh, all right, all right, that's enough. I will not have you bullying this child. This is about getting justice for her mom. Linda. I am not finished. I will not have you instilling fear into her the same way you did Chica. Ada, the police is here, okay? You can speak, and I'm also here. What happened that night? I already told you what happened that night. I, I, I was in the house because she she called me to come rescue her. That was what happened. And then what? Her husband chased after us after we left. And I, I took her to my house. And killed her. No, no, I, I, I did not kill her. I did not. Stop lying to me. Not lying, detective. Not, I'm telling you the truth. So why were you running away from the police? I'm still running away. I'm not running away from the police. To 
Sudah jemput aku di sana. I had some work to do, so I had to leave. That's what happened. Interesting. You suddenly have some work to do after a woman died in your house. No, no woman died in my house. No woman died in my house. What happened was, she collapsed. And I rushed her to the hospital. And she was declared dead. I wasn't there when she was declared dead. I wasn't there. She is dead. That is a common knowledge now. Eh? I mean, that she was declared dead after I left. How is that my fault now? How? How is that my fault? I mean, that the autopsy even confirms that she died of internal bleeding as a result of abuse, uh, broken limbs, and that she even lost a child. How is this my fault? All I did was just to rescue her. That was all I did. Listen to me. I promise you, before the sun goes down, you will be telling the truth. Hello. Hello, detective. I am ready to give my statement. And who is this? Chica. Chica, what was it? The man you're interrogating knows exactly where I am. And he'll bring you to me when you're ready to give my statement. All right. <laughs> Would you like something to drink? Not at all. Thank you. You have a lot of explanations to make. I hear you have my husband in custody. In the case of manslaughter, do you even know what you have done? I had to fake my own death. If I didn't, I want to be sat here talking to you. And I'm sure my friends and family would have told you all that you need to know. Except why and how you faked your death. Why? Because I have the desire to stay alive for myself and for my daughter. So how long are you going to continue like this, Chica? You're lucky Steve was here to save you this time around. Though. I lost my baby. And you could have lost your life. You could have lost your life, Chica. How long are you going to keep punishing yourself like this? Answer me! How do I get out? He would never accept defeat. I can't escape him. Oh no, he has to pay for this. He really has to. I mean, look at you, you're all bruised up. But how? How so, will I make him pay? It will always be his word against mine. Suicide. What? Yeah, suicide. You fake your own death. I mean, he wants you dead anyway. So you might as well give him what he wants. Let him mourn you and grieve you and miss you. And then you just leave the rest to me. Just watch me make him pay. That's too much. It's not too much. It's not too much. After all he's done to you and put you through. Oh, no, 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 no. Come on. Chica, seriously, you need to disappear. Just, just. This is the only way that you can leave this man. You need to disappear. And how about my daughter? How about Adobe? I, I can't leave her behind. Don't ask me to. Uh, you, you know what? It's, it's all right. Okay, Linda, it's okay. I mean, we can't further stress her. Let's talk about it when she's fully recovered, please. I know that, but we, ha we have to do it now or never. That's it. It's either now or never or... Look, 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 guys, just leave the rest to me. All I'm saying is, I just leave it to me. I'll talk to the doctor, and I'm sure we can fake like an autopsy report or something, right? And then, when uh, Wilfred is trying to come and see you, before he gets to see your cops, I'm sure the police will come and arrest him and put him in jail before that wait, time. Wait, 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 you guys seem to be missing out something. I mean, 
I was the last person she was seen with. She was in my house. Now, now, what do you think people would say? I will be the prime suspect. Just, can you just trust me on this one? Just, just, just trust me. Just this once. Chica, are you know this? You know what? And then I realized that I needed to stay alive. But I also wanted to make him pay for what he has done. So what made you change your mind? If you stayed your debt, you wouldn't have been sitting in front of me right now talking. You would have disappeared or something. I needed to make him pay for what he had done to me. But certainly not for what he didn't do. I... I couldn't confront him. I, I had no evidence against him. He would have weakened me. I, I've always felt weak around him. And he would have manipulated me and made me turn against myself like he always does. Your daughter's statement is the reason he's behind bars. And I don't want her to live with that burden for the rest of her life. She did exactly what you're not capable of. Courage. I would like you to go to the station with me to write your statement. Your husband will face a lot of charges, including domestic violence, emotional trauma, and so much more on the list. Then we'll have the court grant you a divorce. And Steve? He will be released. I have to take my leave now. Mom, where did you go? I missed you so much and I'm so lonely and scared. I'm sorry, but I'm not going anywhere again, okay? Huh? Mom, mm -hmm. Dad. Mm -hmm. It's okay, it's okay. Let's focus on what's important right now, okay? Um. I miss my, I miss my angel. I miss my angel so much. I miss you too, mom. <laughs> okay, so go upstairs. Mommy wants to have a conversation with your auntie. And I'll be right there. Will you come? Of course. I just said I will. Now run along. See you soon. <sighs> Thank you. Oh, it's nothing. It's all you. You did this. Look at the brand new chica. I couldn't have done any of this without you. I mean, you brought me out of this darkness, so thank you. It's nothing. It's nothing. And listen, the court will dissolve the marriage, and you, my dear friend, are free to live your new life with your daughter and all of us. Mm. Beside you. Thank you. Look. I'm so sorry you had to go through what you went through. And um, Chica, I'd like to make a promise to you right here and right now that I will always be there for you, okay? You have nothing to worry about. Well, come on. No, no more tears, all right? It's okay. It's okay. You know, if I must say, two of you make the perfect couple. Silly you. Oh, silly me, but always right, right? <laughs> anyway, I must say thank you for all the help and support you you rendered. Yes. I'm truly grateful. Going forward, Adobe and I will need more support and important. love and support. And we'll always be here for you. Always, okay? Okay, I'm freaking <laughs> <yeah>! <laughs> <laughs> it's time for my angel. You gotta run. Okay. Make yourself comfortable. Okay. Ada. Okay. Ada. Ada. <laughs> Say some men aren't what they seem to be. How did it get to this point? Was I a fool for loving you? I want.
to be free from the chill of this ship. I mean, so stay. This is how love is. I don't want it anymore. If this is how love is, I don't want it anymore. Surviving you is really tearing me apart. Surviving you, you is tearing on my heart. Can't do this no more. No more. Can't do this no more. Can't do this no more. How more cruel could this get? I've tried to endure, but I can't go on. Was I blinded from the truth? Mm -hmm. I want to be free from the chill of my mind. Oh, I'm exhausted. I'm exhausted. If this is how love is, I don't want it anymore. If this is how love is, I don't want it anymore. Surviving you is really tearing me apart. Surviving you, you is tearing on my heart. Can't do this no more. Can't do this no more. No more. Can't do this no more.